let's try another example. Lebo purchased a cylindrical urn, which she can boil water. The height of the urn is 60 centimeters and the radius is 20 centimeters as shown below. Calculate the volume of the urn. You may use the formula volume of a cylinder is equal to pi times radius squared times height where pi is equal to 3,142. So it's straightforward. All I have to do is calculate the volume using the formula and the shape is the cylinder. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to, uh, um, I'm going to copy the formula, which is volume is of a cylinder is equal to pi times radius squared times height right and i'm going to say volume here is my unknown and I'm identifying the unknown therefore i have to substitute everywhere else so my volume is unknown and then i'm going before i substitute i'm going to go and check if all my units of measurements are the same they said that my radius is 20 centimeters and my Height is 60 centimeters, right? And um, I have radius there, which is centimeters, and height, which is centimeters. I'm good to go. 3,142 multiplied by radius, which is 20 centimeters. And that is squared because it says radius squared. Multiply the height, which is 60 centimeters right and the rest is just calculating with the calculator i never worry much about that um 20 squared first going to do that part so my volume is equal to 3,142 multiplied by 400 this is now mid centimeter squared multiplied by 60 centimeters my volume is now equal 3.142 multiplied by 400 multiplied by 60 and it gives me 75408 cubic centimeters. Now I'm just going to add one last part there. Had it said leave your answer as in cubic meters. You don't have to convert the answer what you can do is change convert the radius first to meters convert the height to meters and then do your calculations in meters but you also don't have to do that you can just convert the answer so we're going to go ahead and convert the answer with this one so what we're going to do is we're going to say we are changing 75408 centimeters to cube to meter cubed right and we are moving from centimeter to meter now remember king henry died by drinking chocolate milk if we move from centi to meter we are moving from the smallest from smaller to bigger therefore we are going to divide by what so now let's count the zeros it's going to be one two right so it's going to be one and two zeros and then i pause I am not converting centimeters. I'm converting centimeter cubed, right? So therefore, my 100 is to the power 3. And you press your calculators by saying 100 times 100 times 100, and that is a million. So that would be 75408 divided by a million. Right? And then you get your answer, and you are done. You move on with your life.